Hi everyone, welcome to our new session on creating survey 123 form from an existing feature layer. My name is Ojumu Yuluwa Isaac and I am the training manager for Sambos Geospatial Nigeria Limited. Survey 123 has been designed in a way that you can actually create new survey from an existing one. Take for instance, you have an already existing survey that you want to modify. Probably you want to add new properties or you want to remove existing attributes in the survey. Instead of creating a new survey form from the scratch, you can actually reuse that existing survey form. So it's just for reusability. And for you to do that kind of process, you would have to launch your Survey 123 Connect app. So let me launch my Survey 123 Connect. So I launch my Survey 123 Connect. Survey 123 Connect. Okay. You wait for it to load. So in your survey 1 to 3 connect, you have the display of your existing survey forms. But for the purpose of this training, I would want to make use of this existing layer, this new fresh scarcity form. But let us just have an overview of how it looks like so that we can know where we would edit things to remove and things to add. From here, we see that the point is the first followed by the station name, time and others so but for this new survey i want to create i would want the station name to appear first and also i want to add the property of adding picture so that whenever you get to the station you want to take uh, samples from you would have the functionality of taking the picture of how the place looks like so let's get to work so go to your new survey, change the title to whatever you want it to appear. Let me say for scarcity, for scarcity survey. Let me put into bracket training. So this is the name I want it to appear. And let me select the form I want to reuse. So this is it. Create new survey. You see, create new survey. So you wait for it to optimize the survey. So you see, it has already copied those attributes. So for you to modify it, go to SLS form. That is where you can actually edit the attributes you want it to have. So I said earlier that I want to add the picture attribute. So for the type, the type is image. So this image, you select image. The name, let's say station, station image. The name, you, the label you want it to carry, say station picture. And also say that I want the name to appear first. So let me cut this. And put it here so that I can have it first. Then I said I want to change this point to something that we make more sense. Let's say location map. Location map. So if I save this form, you will see how the new survey looks like now. 
So just wait for it to load. So right now you see how the new survey looks like. So you see that the station name comes first now. The point label has been changed to location map. And now we have the station picture where as you can actually capture new pictures or say you have an existing picture on your phone that you want to ask as the as the picture for that place you took the data from you can do that so the purpose of this is just for reusability instead of designing a new survey from the scratch you can actually make use of your array or say you have an existing survey that fits into that purpose you can just add new properties or remove existing uh, parameters that are not needed in it just like the point attributes i changed to location map and also i added the picture property so that you can take pictures of where you took your survey from so in short survey so one two three enables you to reuse new sorry you, you re reuse existing surveys instead of creating new ones from the scratch i hope you enjoyed this uh, session of survey one two three so 